Hi, I'm Joe. I'm Mama D. We're back again. Uh, and today is Happy Mother's Day. Thank you. You're welcome. And Happy Mother's Day to everybody out there. So it, that means it's May 10th, 2020. And we're down to five months on the cruise. Yes, we're still doing this. We're still counting down. Uh, as you can see, we're slowly coming out of hibernation, quarantine, Here in pandemic Texas. in Texas. Yes, of course. So I was very fortunate. I'm not wearing a hat today because I was able to get a haircut yesterday, and I'm very thankful for that. You know, on my Facebook page, I posted a picture of it and said I finally came out of the 80s and back into 2020 with my hair. Yeah. Yep. So, uh, in the meantime, since the last time we uh, were on here, we uh, bought quite a few things for the cruise. And, you know, I mean, it's still stuff that, you know, even if it doesn't happen, you know, we can use. But one of the things that, uh, I got an itch, um, that, uh, uh, <laughs> sorry, it, it did, um, I, you know, we, we've talked about a lot. Uh, going over to the things that you can purchase from uh, the website, the Carnival website, uh, was uh, uh, um, beach towels. Now, I know you get one to use in your room, but if you take it with you, you have to pay for it. So a lot of people just buy them. And we were pricing them, and for a 30 by 60, it was $20. You know, and they really weren't, I mean, there was a, only a section of like two or three different ones that you can choose from that I saw on the website. And it's one of them, I think one of them said Carnival on it, but the rest were just, you know, like beach scenes, things like that. So, again, over at Wally World, we spotted uh, uh, some beach towels. Oversized. So oversized beach towels for oversized people. And uh, these are 38 by 72s. And they were only thirteen dollars, so you know, and that's hers. And uh, I mean, see if I can do this without messing things up here. And of course, I got the pineapple, uh, a little it's shiny there. Down. Okay. All right. And uh, these aside, and uh, so anyway, uh, the crafty missus with her machine is going to put our names on it and things like that. So, speaking of crafty. Uh, one of the things that we debated about until it was brought to our attention by watching one of the our, our one of our favorite videos, which is through EECC Travels, uh, a couple by the name of Jason and uh, Alisa, 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 Alisa. If I'm mispronouncing, I apologize. Anyway, was people decorating their the outside of their cabin doors. And yeah, it's kind of cheesy and everything, but it really made sense when Jason had made mention that if you look down the corridors of these cabins, they're like super long uh, motel room cabin doors on either side, and everything is exactly alike. Okay, so finding your room, you know, could, you know, even though they're numbered, you know, take you a little while. So people decorate their doors. So hey, hey there's my door. It's three more doors down. You know, or whatever. And it was, you know, got us to thinking. And Miss Crafty here, Mama D, <laughs> made up a little. This is one of the things. Whoop, the little thing over there that is going to be on our door. And I keep the thing keeps popping over. It says, you know, husband and wife, cruise partners for life, and then our names and, you know, where we live and all that. So that was pretty neat. And um, by the way, if anybody out there wants something like this made. Contact Mama D. So, anyway, that and, uh, uh, you know, we, of course, again, back to the everything's my, uh, everything's not magnetic. Everything's metal on the ship. The doors and everything. We got the magnetic hooks to hang stuff. And, uh, again, another shout out to Jason there. To e -E 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 -C -C Travels. I know. <laughs> I know. Sounds funny, but... Anyway, uh, uh, who gave us the idea for these things? To put in your suitcase. Put in your suitcase makes everything smell nice, you know. You, you know you smell nice now. That put up smell, you know, or whatever they call it. And 
dry erase markers with a dry erase board, okay, to hang on the door for people to write notes or whatever, however you want to do it. And um, of course, you know about the from the previous videos the backpacks that we bought and everything, and uh, you know, uh, not wanting to carry wallets or, or a bunch of stuff. Uh, we spotted this thing. Um, it's RFD. Yeah, it's protection. RFID stop. And it's to carry your driver's license, driver's license, your passports, everything all in one convenient place for the pickpocket to grab it and run. They got everything now. No. <laughs> in, in all seriousness, no. This, of course, this would be in, you know zipped up in your backpack or wherever. You know, it's not something you would have hanging out or, you know walking around with is flashing it but uh, you know definitely a, a, an easier way than having your you know your wallet or whatever in your back pocket or even putting it in your front pocket or whatever so that, you know uh, at least in your backpack you know the only way somebody's gonna get that is if they actually rip it off of you which uh, I, you know I'm, I don't foresee that happening you know but uh, you never know but Anyway, uh, yeah, it's pretty neat though. I mean, because you know, it's got the strap and everything, but it also has this little mesh back here and stuff like that. I mean, it's it's pretty nice. Uh, Amazon. Yes. Amazon. Yeah. You know, uh, lots of uh, Amazon and uh, eBay shopping and stuff like that. But uh, again, you know, we're down to to uh, five months on this, and uh, we're getting there. You know, and and as we come out of this quarantine. Thing. We're getting more and more, you know, uh, we're looking forward to it more. I don't want to say excited or elated or anything like that. I just, you know, it's, it's just, still up in the air. Yeah, every, it, you know, nothing's ever written in stone. You know, it's, you know, we just have to wait and see, you know, but um, we, you know, we hope that uh, everything works out and we stay on schedule. Because as of right now, uh, I know Carnival is going back into service August 1st, I believe. Mm -hmm. Right? And so that gives it, you know, a few months for everybody else to try it out and see how things go. And, you know, uh, and we see uh, what October is going to look like. Um, is there anything else? I mean, I'm, I'm trying to... Uh, no. No, you, you just... You, you, I went blank. You went blank. You, you, you ain't got nothing to say on this, huh? Wow. No, not today. Not today, huh? Well, at any rate, um, something I wanted to mention for those of you on our Facebook pages, because I, you know, the only way for our family and friends to know that we're even doing these things is for us, for me to post a link from YouTube over to the Facebook page. And I mention every time, or we mention every time, to like and subscribe. For those of you who don't know much about YouTube pages, subscribing to a YouTube page costs nothing. All you do is hit that button, subscribe. And all that does is add it to your subscribed list of your favorite YouTube pages. And it allows you to be able to go to them easily instead of searching for them every time. You know, they're under subscriptions. It, you know, there is no subscription fee, you know, that you would think of with like a newspaper or a magazine or something like that. It's right. not that kind of subscription. It's, it's just, uh, you know, you're subscribing to be posted or to know that that's where those pages are. So for all my friends and relatives that were worried about that, don't be. Just subscribe, you know. I, we're in limbo here with four subscribers so far. I don't even know who they are. They won't tell you. It, you, you can't even find out who the, your <laughs> subscribers are. You just it just says secret four admirers. Subscribers. Yeah, the secret admirers. Right. <laughs> we we we'd like to be you know admired less secretively and you know more subscribed to. <laughs> yeah. So at any rate, um, and again, you know, I still can't figure out the notification bell thing. So if anybody out there can tell me what how they get that on their page, you know, uh, because what the notification bell is, I've, what I do know about it is, is if you subscribe to a page and you hit that bell, 
then whenever a new episode or whenever something is posted on that, on like no, Joe no. and Mama D's page, it notifies you, hey, they've got a new episode up or they've got a new posting on YouTube. And it just, you know, just like getting a, a, a I don't want to say text message or something like that, but it notifies. That's what the no- notification bell is. Ding! Bell. And, <laughs> well, that's what it is. So, anyway, uh, if anybody can tell me how to get that bell put on there so that, or if i got to get to a certain number of subscribers before I get a bell, you know, let me know. Uh, because I've searched everywhere and I can't get an answer on it. But other than that, subscribe, please. Like it, you know. If you enjoy seeing our lovely faces, faces then, you know, please do. I mean, we're going to be posting more of these, I told you, all the way up until the, the cruise. And, and and during the cruise, you know, I'll be still recording some more stuff, you know, uh, uh, off of us uh, on this adventure that we're working towards and uh, uh, you know so if you know if you wish you're subscribed to us then you get to be first in line at any rate we hope ever, all the moms out there have a wonderful Mother's Day and we'll see you in about another month bye bye